Sometimes it's two hours, sometimes it's three. They always want it to go longer. They're always sad when it's over. Yeah, I think the wooden chair is good. At her portrait studio in downtown Camas, Lara Blair's mission is simple. The whole point is to celebrate and to empower whoever's being photographed. Wow. We are all about it. We're excited about who they are and what they love. Lara is a mom of two girls and a former middle school teacher. There is no insecurity like a sixth grader. <laughs> Good, that's beautiful. Pandemic or not, she knows how tough life can be on kids. So she created what she calls the kaleidoscope session. In this moment, 10-year-old Tenley Blue Bridges is the focal point. The kaleidoscope session is what we offer kids. And we do photograph a lot of girls. It's open to boys as well. I love this one. They can just let down and be who they are and not worry about being judged and not worry about the girl drama and the social media. And none of that exists here in these sessions. I can express myself like in different ways. She's amazing. She's an amazing kiddo. Tony Bridges is the proud mom. She's a strong girl. And I think it just gives her even more confidence going into this stage of life. Tenley Blue was born with two congenital heart defects. They weren't diagnosed until she was almost four. And she was already having some arrhythmias. She had already suffered some significant heart damage. And so it was like, surprise. And 11 days later, she had open heart surgery. She's kind of remarkable for 10. It's just really empowering these young girls to have a voice and have an opinion. And, and it's totally OK. Art is very powerful in terms of seeing yourself in a new light. And if you've got a warrior picture of yourself in your bedroom and you're 12, it makes a really big difference. Lara sees these kids for who they are and loves to celebrate and elevate them, changing the way they see themselves. I want them to leave feeling confident in all the things that are unique to them. To not feel like they have to fit in all the time, you know, to feel like they can stand out and that's okay. In Camus, John Goodwin, KGW News.